If your wilderness wireless internet goes offline, then follow these steps to troubleshoot the issue. Ensure that your computer or device is still connected to your Wi-Fi network. Ensure that the PoE power supply has a green power light indicating it's on. Ensure that your router is turned on. Inspect Ethernet wires from PoE power supply to router and from the outdoor antenna to the PoE. The green Ethernet cable goes from the green port of the PoE to the WAN port of your router. Think of this as your internet connection. The yellow Ethernet cable goes from the outdoor antenna to the yellow port of the PoE power supply. Ensure that all of these Ethernet cables are firmly plugged into the ports. Reboot the outdoor antenna by unplugging the PoE power supply from power and then plugging it back in. Reboot your router by unplugging it from power, then plugging it back in. Wait a few minutes and then try the internet once more. Go outside and view the outdoor antenna to see if severe wind has clearly changed the direction the antenna was pointing when first installed. If it is clearly pointing in the wrong direction, you must call tech support to schedule a service call to correct the issue. However, if the antenna is indeed pointed correctly, then also see whether snow or ice has built up around the antenna, blocking the wireless signal. Harsh weather conditions can cause issues for the wireless connection. But if the outdoor antenna looks fine and there are no visible issues, then call tech support to find out whether there has been an internet outage. If an outage has occurred, a message will let you know the expected time for recovery. If there has not been an outage, then please troubleshoot the issue further with Wilderness Wireless Tech Support. Another possible cause of being offline could be that you changed out your wireless router without first notifying Wilderness Wireless Tech Support. When changing out a wireless router, first contact tech support to have the new router authenticated on your account. The vast majority of these issues will be corrected quickly by following these steps. So please download and print a copy of the instructions to have them handy in the event of an internet failure.